Welcome back. This is day 90 of the series, 365 Days of Wellness. Can you believe we're a quarter of the way through the year already? All right, let's talk knee pain. Are you aware that your knee pain is probably coming from your hips? Sounds crazy, but it's true. Your hip muscles, 17 muscles to be exact, play an important role in the function of the hips and surrounding bones and joints. They also control the position of your knees while walking, running, or jumping. Here's the thing, if any of those hip muscles are weak, tight, or both, they can affect the alignment of the knee joint while at rest and while in movement. You just cannot function properly with any hip tightness or weakness. Our hips impact everything we do from sitting to standing to twisting to reaching to bending and walking stepping etc in essence the hips contain all of life's movements and power so trying to stretch them with a simple static stretch is just not going to work you need to attack those muscles from different angles and with different techniques in order to correct it and get it to release the best approach for knee and hip health is a workout regimen that combines both stretch and strength. In other words, mobility and stability. Please know that if you have knee pain, you might need exercises to strengthen your hip muscles. Knee pain is a sign that you are at risk for a knee injury or other part of your leg. Listen, I get it. I just spent an hour last night stretching the hip muscles because I was having knee pain and knew that it was a tight IT band. It kind of puts things into perspective, huh? Reach out with any questions. And of course, check back tomorrow for more health and wellness tips. Click that like, subscribe to the channel.